what is going on everybody we're back in again with another stream and video i'm also yeah i'm also uploading this this uh, gameplay to my my video channels uh we're, we're playing the second season of batman the telltale series where we're continuing where we left off at the end of uh, season one episode five uh, this is this, yeah. This is a continuation so, uh, of my old my old uh, sto uh, stories that I played in season one, and the choices I made in season one are are let's say um are connected and imported uh, to season two. So I had season one, and uh, it reflects on uh, on the, on this season, season two. And uh, it depends how I will take the path. I believe uh, I took, I would say I took a, a rather, uh, you know, an anti-hero path, you know. Like, but Batman was not, like, too, uh, too, good uh, too good issues. Like, he wasn't, uh, he didn't, uh, like, say, he was not soft. But he also, he was not cruel. I didn't also also didn't take a a villain approach, so I would I would I would say uh, I would like in between the middle, you know, an antihero, making sure things are in order, but not make sure I don't go soft on anybody. But so we'll see. Uh, in, in this in this season 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 uh, season two, let's see what it has in store for me. All right, let's get it. Oh yeah, I have to, I have to choose a back tech color. I think last time I was I was red. Hmm. Should I choose a different color? Save that blue, yellow, purple. I chose red because you know it, it it was like totally badass. You know, gives it gives it an intimidating look. But we'll see. Uh, you know what? I would go with the, a calm, vibrant color, which is purple, a smooth color. But yeah, it also does look. Keep, he also um, keeps the badass look, uh, Batman. So yeah, I'll go with purple. All right, let's go. choices you make depends on how you play one fateful night my parents gave their lives for me they became my heroes their legacy untouchable until I learned the truth my father Thomas Wayne was a criminal he ruled over Gotham from the shadows and everything I thought I knew about myself changed forever the children of Arkham exposed the truth about my father to Gotham. Their attack turned friends into enemies and threw the city into chaos. I was committed to Arkham Asylum, where I escaped with the help of a mental patient named John Doe. After a bloody battle, I put an end to it all in the catacombs beneath the city. The Penguin, Two-Face, and Lady Arkham were the first real challenge I faced as the Batman, but they would not be the last. Spring has arrived in Gotham, and with it comes City Hall's quarterly crime report. Crime is way down since the fall of the children of Arkham, marking another triumph for newly minted police commissioner James Gordon. In a statement this morning, Gordon credited his success to the public partnership between the police and the Batman. He praised the mysterious vigilante for his sacrifice, describing him as essential to the security of the city. Things are looking up, citizens. After the long, dark winter <laughs> comes the thaw. Now, if only the Knights could win a game, everyone would be happy. Lucky 13! There it is. Rumi Mori, import-export magnet, one-time Pipex CEO. 
international arms dealer. The world sees Maury as a legitimate businessman, a philanthropist who gives to charity, not a criminal getting rich off the suffering of innocence, a masterful performance. I wonder if a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? Bruce, must be hard to stay true to yourself. Go with Bruce never forgets. I don't. I never forget what drives me. Protecting the innocent from people like Maury. That stays the same no matter what mask I wear. Don't I know? Masks are hard to maintain. We'll find them. The GCPD already bugged his penthouse and found nothing. Meaning that if he's doing arms deals in Gotham... They happen on the casino floor. I need to find a way to hear what Maury is saying. Standing by for support. Look for something with a microphone. Well, looks like Roulette is his Achilles heel. He has a reputation for being lucky. But then you don't need luck when you own the house. Oh, security. Hotel security are guarding him particularly close. A man like Maury counts more enemies than friends. I wonder why that is. He certainly enjoys the good life, doesn't he? Made a fortune running guns during the Arab Spring. Diversified into biotech shortly after. From what I understand, he is not one for pinching pennies. Mm, check around. All right, last one. Uh, look at oh, yeah. Maury's consumer model. Could be a good way to hear Maury's conversation. Like no, I'm hacking into Maury's phone. Encrypting your signal. Last thing we want is for him to know you're here. We're in. You should be able to pick up audio from Maury's phone. Is everyone enjoying themselves? Don't worry. Yeah, say I often know how to tell anyone with the bad bad. He's on a bad roll. <laughs> it's only it's a matter of time before he gets too chatty. <laughs> Try to blend in. Blend in, alright. Keep it cool, keep it cool. So, I've been sitting over there wondering, what's Bruce Wayne doing in a place like this? I figured you went to fancier casinos. Some place where only high rollers go. Uh, I'll play along. I'm looking for something different. New thrills. Well, it's a good thing you're here. And it's a good thing I'm here. Ooh. You? Escort. What in the hell are you doing here? Stop me if you've heard this one before. I begin and have no end. And I end all that begins. Oh, Who am I? I? I don't give a damn. I told you ten times. Our arrangement is over. Death, Maury. I am death. Something's happening, and it doesn't look like a deal. The man in the hood. I remember him from your father's time. I think that's Riddler. Oh shit, about to go down. All right. Is something wrong? You seem distracted. Oh, that could be cool. Bruce. Uh, you think your gibberish intimidates me? Hello? Him. You'd better gear up. You can't just blow me off. How about we go back to my place? Oh. I'll call my driver. Meet me outside. Well, since you put it like that, I never do this, you know. You know, me neither. No one threatens me in my own casino. Right, Security! Cool. No Sir, it's time to leave. For you? An easy one. What question can you never answer yes to? I don't give a crap, let's go. <sighs> Wrong. The correct answer is, are you dead? Let's get started. Get out of there. Get your suit. Let's go. Let's go. Now, 
Let Gordon know what's happening. Right away. Hey, no one leaves. Scrambling audio now. Gordon. Batman, what's the status? Multiple gunmen, hostages at the casino. A madman in a mask. I can guard them. Riddler? He hasn't been seen in years. Well, he's putting on quite a show. Time. There's a squad on the way. They'll be there shortly. Be ready for a fight. Our issues can't be solved with handshakes, Maury. This is what happens when you back out of a deal with me. There's only one way you're getting out of this alive. You have to solve a riddle. And I'd choose my words carefully if I were you. Listen closely. No, please, don't do this! Without fingers, I point. Without arms, I strike. Without feet, I run. Who am I? I've got visual. That drone, fully functional. Oh, the glass shows the purple. Looks badass. I'll need a place to drop in without being noticed. Time for some recon. Alright, time to scan. tricky one, isn't it? A mind bender. Riddler. A terror from the past. I never thought I'd see him on our streets again. He's not to be taken lightly. It's the kind of conundrum that drives... Some kind of torture device. ...out until he guesses the riddle. This Riddler certainly has an imagination. Oh, it never gives you a moment's peace. Believe me, I know. Oh. Remember... Riddler's taken hostages, casino patrons, innocent bystanders. Now they're clearly not his main target. Must be an insurance policy. Don't think you can just stall. I will get bored. You won't like that. Cashier's booth. That'll do. Just need to take out the guard first. Audio playback fully functional. Time for a distraction. Go down. Let's go. I'm losing patience, Maury. Are you expecting a hint? Give me an answer! Batman! We can't get in. The front's covered by gunmen and they've got the back barricaded with blackjack tables. How should I deploy when we're inside? I'm relying on your eyes and ears. What's the best course of action? Uh, let's smoke them out. We need Take a gas. distraction. Find a way to limit their line of sight. Sounds like a plan. You're completely insane! No. I don't believe that's it. I'll clear a path. Wait for my signal. Give him hell. We're counting on you. Batman! 
Batman! You're ahead of schedule. I'm a little busy right now, but I'll see if I can fit you in. Not him, the hostage! Shoot the hostage! Bring it, bitch. I've heard stories in the streets about you, Batman. You're the biggest name in Gotham since... well... since I left town. Everyone's very impressed with you. I'm not impressed. Gotham's criminals have become zealots and thugs in cheap suits. And you... I've come home to find a wannabe in my chair. Eating my goddamn porridge! This is my city! Now I'm back, and I'm taking what's mine. You're all scum. All you scum are the same. Only thing that changes is the mask. Spoken like a man who sees the world in black and white. Allow me to broaden your spectrum. You're supposedly the world's greatest detective. Yet here you are, completely at my mercy. to be kidding. Clever, but not smart enough. Let me show you how it was done back in the day. doesn't do it for me. <laughs> Don't. Oh, no, no! oh my gosh. I say this. Oh, that's quite bad, too, but I was right. For now. Follow the power lines. There must be a weak point. That's cheating! Think I care about your rules? I'd heard you were a man who followed a code. Why would you save that dirtbag's life? Mm. Maury made oh, his yeah, money running bags. guns, trading off the suffering of war. Why well, wouldn't he you just to have let a trial. him die? Justice. I believe in justice. Maury deserves a trial in a court of law. If he's guilty, his cell will be right next to yours. Justice? Ridiculous. Either way, you won't be the one to put me there. Body 
Enough of this! You know how to scrap. I'll give you that. But it's not enough. Let's see how you do with something a little more cerebral. Better hurry, detective. Solve my puzzle soon. Or people are gonna get hurt. And we know you can't let that happen. Guys, take that. Uh, you should have called us before going suits. in, Gordon. Waller. After all, we're here to help. Not detectives. Ah, feds. Side, but nothing obviously dangerous. The back computer will be able to analyze further. Your days are numbered, bat freak. We'll see each other again. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Keep one eye in the sky, jerk offs. That's Montoya. Heavens are gonna fall on your goddamn heads. Tell me all about it down at the precinct. The Riddler's right hand in custody. Not a bad result, all told. Riddler used to leave clues at all his crime scenes. Always thought he was smarter than the people trying to catch him. Thought we could use help dragging him down. They got a sick pleasure out of taunting us. That's because he hadn't met me. That's for damn sure. You don't know how glad I am you're here, working with the police. Riddler's heyday was a dark time in Gotham. And what we just saw, he hasn't mellowed with age. Uh-huh. Get Fernandez on it right away. Commissioner Gordon. Brace yourself. Just so you know, this woman has a lot of juice with the governor. Rub her the wrong way. I could end up on foot patrol till I retire. My people yeah. are trained for situations like this, Gordon. We'd have Riddler in custody if you'd only picked up the phone. So, you're the legendary Batman. I've heard a great deal about you. So much so, I don't know if I should believe the hype. And you are? And you are. This is Amanda Waller, director of the agency. What are the feds doing here? No, it feds. Riddler's their case. The GCPD has been asked to open our doors to them. Give them whatever they need. We've been tracking that maniac for some time. And yet we no one GCPD had to do the work. Need. Nor are you. World class criminals like Riddler. They're kind of our specialty. To be honest, I never heard of I've them. never heard of this agency. I'll take that as a compliment. We like to keep a low profile. <laughs> that means she operates from the shadows. As do you. Riddler used to be a player in Gotham back when Thomas Wayne and Falcone ran the city. He disappeared so suddenly and for so long, everyone thought he was dead. <laughs> everyone was wrong. Riddler's back, and if these theatrics are anything to go by, he wants the whole city to know. My people tell me you did some good work handling him, Batman. You and me? I bet we'd make a damn fine team. I heard how you dealt with Lady Arkham. Not to mention that filth 
Oswald Cobblepot. We could do uh, great no, things you together know. if we join forces. Gordon, yes. I work with Gordon. No one else. I appreciate loyalty, but that there... That's the issue. The only real problem with your setup is who you're working with. Local law enforcement clearly can't cut. I got a local crime rate says otherwise. <laughs> Ms. Waller... Please, Commissioner. Tear gas. In a hostage situation, we got an ambulance full of civilians with their eyes swollen shut. Not to mention you let Riddler slip through your fingers. You GCPD cowboys clearly don't know what you're doing. You're putting all this on me? You're the commanding officer, aren't you? Or are those stars purely for show? No, I made a call. You can't put this on Jim. I called for a distraction. Then maybe you're not as impressive as I thought. I'm here to prevent this incompetence in the future. I gotta get a security detail on Mori while he's in the hospital. Agent Avesta will fill you in on what we know so far. As a token of interdepartmental cooperation. That we don't need, but you gotta thrust the yourself nerve on her. Don't tell these people a thing, especially about that puzzle. This is our town. We're the ones that'll catch Riddler. Word. Oof. I thought she was gonna bite your head off for a second. Uh, I'd like to see her try. Special Agent Iman Avesta, Field Intelligence Specialist on the Riddler case. And my partner, Agent Blake. How do you do? I put together this psychological profile of Riddler. You'll see when you read it. He's... changed. For your eyes only, <laughs> if you catch my drift. The target of the casino attack, Rumi Mori. Any idea what Riddler wanted with him? We figure it has something to do with why he's back in Gotham. He's a madman. You can't look for reason in someone so clearly deranged. Riddler does show signs of an obsessive compulsive disorder, but he's calculating, fiercely intelligent. I'd be surprised if this wasn't part of a bigger plan. Let me know if you think of anything. It'd be a help. <clears throat> I'm Gotham born and raised, you know. My dad ran a store in the shadow of City Stadium. I just wanted to say it's a real honor to meet you. I do have something I want to ask, though. Oh, a fan. A criminally Fangirl. insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? There's something in you that pulls you towards the danger, the chaos. Seems like she's interrogating me. You can't keep away. In a mild can manner. You? I don't like what you're insinuating. Uh, of course, I. Keep your pop's psych evaluations to Riddler and stay out of my head. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to pry. I think I know you a little better now. I'll be in touch, Agent. Batman, before you go, Gotham's your city. I respect that. But you should know I don't have to play nice. Yeah, I'm letting I... you hunt the Riddler for now. You better share everything you find. Or this courtesy call is going to become something you really won't like. What do you mean by that? You get me? There's a lot of ways this could go. Stay, out, stay out of my way, Waller, and I'll stay out of yours. Clear. An eventful evening. I have taken the liberty of preparing some refreshments. Uh, thanks, Al. I need to focus. 
Maybe music will help. Hmm. Classical, ambient, jazz. Uh, let's go with jazz. I need something cool. The computer is finished scanning the Riddler's puzzle box. It's ready when you are. Let's get to work. Oh, check the back gate. All right, let's see. This belongs to Cat. Ah, uh, Selena. Plus Catwoman. Selena and Kyle came to Gotham to perform a number of robberies for the children of Arkham. Though she eventually helped me stop them, she left, and I don't know where. Either she will ever return. Despite our differences, I enjoy sparring with her. Yeah, she make, we make a, they make a good team. Batman and her. Uh, oh yeah, Harvey Dent, old friend. To face uh, Harvey Dent was once a promising mayoral candidate and one of my closest friends. I supported his campaign and his vision for Gotham. After he was attacked, uh, sorry, attacked by the children of Arkham, he became Two Face, a violent deeply paranoid criminal. During his spree stint as mayor, he used his authority to enforce martial law throughout the city. Damn. Bruh. He, he turned, like, as soon as he became two-faced, he became fascist really fast. Uh, Penguin. Uh, oh, it belongs to Oswald Cobblepot. Penguin was a terrorist, anarchist, anarchist, and my oldest friend, born to one Oh yeah. Went to one of Gotham's most prestigious, prestigious family. He he lived abroad after his mother was committed to Arkham Asylum by my father. He returned to Gotham to join to join the children of Arkham seeking revenge on my family for destroying his. Uh, Lady Arkham, uh, Vicky Vale, terrorist leader. Vicky Vale was a well-known and respected reporter at the Gotham Gazette. But she was born Vicky Arkham, a victim of my father's criminal activities. She created her alter ego, Lady Arkham, and her terrorist organization, the Children of Arkham, to destroy Gotham's elite. I defeat her, but I don't know if she's alive or dead. Her body was never found. Oh yeah, that's, that's when... Oh yeah, I forgot. I'll put a hell of a fight, and I think she went down, but I can't confirm. Oh, is that it? Okay. Alright, that's it. Oh, oh I got all the trophies. Gels here. Alright, let's go to the back cave. Let's see. Uh, let's go to this part. The first. Oh, wait. This upgraded model after my battle with Lady Arkham last year. The suit has improved armaments, shielding, and scanning technology. What's next? Uh, let's see. Anchor ha heavy grappling device. I can't be everywhere at once, but this design makes it easier easier to take care of business from across the room. Whether that business is resting weapons away from criminals or stopping something heavy from bystanders from so heavy from <laughs> something heavy from falling on bystanders oh, oh wait. Uh, let's see I see all oh, the previous bat suit yeah, let's see my suit always takes a lot of damage but still does what it's supposed to do hide my identity to criminals oh this is the old one oh it's the same thing uh no oh, wrong way Uh, grappling gun. This gun allows me essential freedom of movement around the city, whether that's from building to building or straight up from a crowd of enemies. My batarangs, multi grape titanium weapon, a few of those, I mean, a few of these can clear out a room full of gunmen, heavy, sleek, and extremely sharp. That's good. Smoke grenades, these grenades create a smoke, smoke screen that confuses the en enemy to and allows me. Died and strike from the shadows. 
stun. And this, this device can help the crim cold criminal with a powerful electric shock. It's flashy and unsubtle as a guarantee to incapacitate in a target no matter their size. Alright. Uh, yeah, that's good. Anything else I missed? Let me see. Oh, okay, we're good. Alright, let's get to Riddler's box. No explosives detected, no radioactivity. Nothing dangerous at all so far. Computer, run another scan. I want to be absolutely sure this thing is safe. Also, I took the liberty of digging up everything I could find on the agency. There's plenty here. Know your enemy and all that. Oh shit, what's wrong with wrong? It, it comes and goes. Ever since the kidnapping and all the other business with Lady Arkham. Alfred. <clears throat> Nana, don't you worry about me. No, I, I, I should be fine. It was Someone's worse after my Makes first words. tour of duty. Your family, Alfred. We worry about family. Thank you, Bruce. It'll pass. Working always helps. All right, nice. Got it. The public support. I'm not gonna I'm just gonna. I need to get who you guys I care that makes things safer. Said grocery store owner Wayne Bart. His business has been a 50% spike in sales after dark in recent months. Huh? When enterprises stock hits with a high, awesome. Make that moolah. Removed from C. Wayne was removed from CEO position last year and replaced with. Oswald Coppola in a move that resulted in Wayne publicly assaulting Coppola, rightfully so, he deserved it, and briefly admitted to Arkham Asylum, which I don't deserve to, long, to, to be in. I since claimed the assault was side effect of drug injection. It was, sure was, in the hands of former Gazette reporter Vicky Vale, who conducted criminal business on the, lady, the, the name Lady Arkham. Then trial pushed back again. Oh yeah, I forgot he's, he's in jail. Let's go. Oh, he lost his legal team. Oh, he's representing himself. Since Corporal Hawkins said, I no longer feel I could defend Mr. Denton to the best of my ability. He's still in jail for two more months while dead for his case. This is the fourth delay to the trial and the third set of attorneys in part of ways with Dent, who is facing multiple charges of murder, criminal death, and fraud. Oh, horrible what happened to you, bro? Damn. Shame. What is the agency? You seem to. Hmm. It's a crime fire. It's a crime fire. Mysterious government entity. Mysterious government entity. Not, not so good. Um, there's evidence of federal crime fire. What is it by this name? I'm not so sure because it only has one that is the absent of several crimes in the extra. I have no idea who these people are. They're in charge. Hmm. How about Mark? Model, fuck out of here, model prison in my ass. Oh, might be told to just skim through it. Uh, I'm just a terrorist organization. Good. Pleaded guilty to all charges against him. Sentenced to 40 years. Should have been life or the death penalty. To be served in Blackgate. His rulings were spread. He sent to the court here. Court that all counts for his majority in life. I don't have a bad thing to say about him. He won Blackgate card. He wished to remain anonymous. You get to talk to him, he's actually pretty charming and super smart. It's all in that. Uh, let's check the codex. Alright, it's a lot to go through. Let's see. Let's see, press the dreams for myself. Mm -hmm. Let's see if everything's like to have. 
Alright, good. Let's have a not favorite true group clap. Advanced I was under influence of Lady Arkham's drug while she committed the crime. I admire her name's dedication to law enforcement and for loyalty to John. That's good. This fox. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he's the I think he's I don't wanna call him a psych, he's my my part my partner, definitely. He can is all the tech. He's just it's a equal partner. This is what you gonna get to depend on. She's a Gotham native and she's confident. She's also a huge fan of Batman. Just somewhat relieved. Maybe I can use that to my advantage. Mm -hmm. with the agency. Not a wall, the stuck up one. Gotta keep a look on these suits, feds. Further, I'll whoop this ass. I'll do it again. I got James IQ. Scumbag here. That's all I can say. He's just scumbag. Let's see what hurts in the darkest shadow. Thomas Wayne. It was not perfect. Martha Wayne thinks she was innocent all this. She is stupid. Uh, God of City. 10 million, huh? Her eyes are down. The villains are becoming more. Hmm. Luckily, Batman's here. Here for a couple of days. Wow, that was in 1870. Crying, oh yeah, when Thomas and Martha did, was killed in the front boobs by Joe. Shit. Okay, good. Part, yeah, they announced the partnership. Alright, that's good. A little more. It's good to work in here. More tight budgets. Everything you need to fight crime. Okay, let's check Riddler files. Yes. Riddler terrorized this city long before you were Batman. Gotham's original costumed criminal. Yes, to have him returned, it's unsettling. I remember when he was the scourge of the underworld. Even Carmine Falcone gave him a wide berth. He was presumed dead for so long. Why come back to Gotham? Well, he seemed to have a prior relationship with Mori. Some kind of axe to grind. Let me upload the rest of this to the Codex. The agency realized Riddler was still alive when he orchestrated a prison break at Peña Duro. My men here say you let yourself get caught, Mr. Riddler. Just Riddler. Why willingly turn yourself in? Oh, Mr. Warden, to get everyone else out, of course. That wasn't obvious. The man's deranged. If you ask me, he needs help. He's clearly sick. The man is in urgent need of a doctor. The Arkham has room. I know just the place for him. Plenty of room at Arkham Asylum. Next to him, most of the inmates seem like a picture of health. What was that? You should see your face. Its confusion is delightful. I think I'll take it with me. <laughs> I take everything back. All right, let's check the agency files. The agency. The public face of a shadow committee of military leaders, intelligence experts, and government officials. Civil rights violations, domestic black sites, decentralized accountability. 
There's information. It's all before Waller took over the director position. Perhaps she's given them a new direction. Maybe. But the agency's empowered to override local law enforcement with impunity. Well, that man's got some competition in town. I wonder if we need be worried about losing our unpaid and thoroughly exhausting job. All of this seems I mean, dangerous, sketchy. The Riddler's a flashy homicidal maniac with a thing for puzzles, and Waller and her agency might be just as dangerous. Again, Waller may be running a more ethical operation these days. See what Riddler's little gift is all about. Solve my puzzle soon, or people will get hurt. Well, Riddler's MO hasn't changed in all these years. There's writing engraved along the rim. I have an eye, yet cannot see. Who am I? That sounds familiar. I've heard it before. Don't happen to remember the answer, do you? Sadly, no. I have one eye, but cannot see. Justice. Justice. How it relates to Batman, maybe. Lady Justice is blindfolded to show she's impartial. She has two eyes under the blindfold, though. Not one. So it's something else. Hmm. When I check, I remember. She gave this to me at a casino. Card games. Maybe a jack. Specifically a one-eyed Jack. But he's on the card twice, showing both eyes. Besides, he can still see. So it's probably not that. Yep. The eye of a needle. But how does that relate to the object in question? Maybe it's telling us how to use it. Uh, sounds very plausible. Look at these strange grooves. It does look... When I opened it, it uh, turned to like a black circle. It does look like a... A vinyl. Oh yeah, record. Needle. A record needle. Yeah, yeah, that was correct. Halfway there, Batman. Means you've got half a chance of stopping a whole lot of pain. To be honest, you're already doing better than I thought. But don't sit around feeling pleased with yourself. Unless you want to see me tear the city apart. I suppose you're going to look in there. An open invitation from the Riddler? Of course. Huh. Looks like I'm manipulating radio bands or waveforms. Something. I'm not sure what I'm looking at or how any of it is actually displaying. And a signal? And that sound. What? Oh, uh... I'm not really sure about any of it. Get Lucius on the line, will you? Alfred. Good morning, Lucius. I hope we're not interrupting your breakfast. My youngest is probably stealing all the bacon, but duty calls. What's up? This is a puzzle from the Riddler. 
There's a strange waveform pattern I can manipulate inside that needs your expertise. I, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I can meet you at Wayne Tower in a little bit. We'll, uh, fire up the R&D lab. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important, Lucius. No, no, don't worry about it. It's actually gonna be a big day for me. Tiffany starts at Wayne Enterprises. Tiffany? Really? Your daughter working alongside you. How wonderful. Uh, certainly is. Bruce, I'll see you soon. Bye, Lucius. Can't wait to see Tiffany. I'll be at Wayne Tower. What's up, Aaron? Back on top. Big CEO oh, on deck. Excellent. Oh. I'm glad I caught you. I have some good news to share. Oh, you you trying to kick me out of my own company? To what fire your ass. Expect with you as Wayne Enterprises chairperson. Damn. I just talked to the board, and they couldn't be more pleased with how our partnership with GCPD is going. Seems like you made the right call when you decided to take that contract over the Arkham remodel. The Gazette's running a piece about it. Look, I would love to hear all the details, but I've got a meeting with Lucius I've got to run to. Well, I don't mean to pry, but... Fire you. What's in that case? Seems like an odd thing to be carrying around the office. Sure, did, did, did you kick me out, but... None Why, of this Regina? Cool. You're... Yep. Forget I asked. Go okay, cool shoulder, good. Well, I've got a meeting I've got to run to. We'll pick up this conversation this afternoon. Sounds great. Now, I fired her. Kicked me out of my company. Doing a hostile takeover. You're in my chair. Just updating the encryption on your bat tech. But if you want me to stop. Oh, no, the seat is all yours. This is the thing you were talking about? One of Riddler's puzzles. Some kind of test. Show me. Huh. Any idea what he's planning? Not yet. That's why I need your help. If his history is anything to go by, he left us a clue. A psychological profile of Riddler. Uh, knowing how his mind works, this should come in handy. No sign of explosives or poison. Already scanned for that in the cave. Look at that. Micro pulse waveform. Ah, the sound it's giving off. A signal, maybe? <laughs> I couldn't decipher it. I was hoping you could help with that. I'll see what I can do. Shouldn't take long. Oh, so. Oh, you draw it. And the. Uh, it's not one of mine. Think fast. Tiffany? Hey, Bruce. T my God, Tiffany. It's been a while. Sneaking out of orientation your first day? I just wanted to say hi to my new boss. I got oh. you a present. A micro drone prototype I developed in my spare time. Oh, looks good. High-end AV, stealth black shell, programmable for autonomous observation. Small, quiet, and super smart. Just like its designer. Not bad, huh? You always had a thing for toys. So hard to know what to get a man who has everything. So I good. made you some tech the man, government would be it. jealous of. I love it. Thanks, Tiffany. Well, I guess it's not bad. Not bad. See what I had to deal with growing up? Huh. There's something different about you. Uh, there is. And I don't just mean what happened to your ear. Oh, yeah, shit. I can't quite put my finger on it, but you look, you look, you look, look, 
badass. I think the uh, the word you're looking for is badass. Um, no, that is Come definitely on. not what I meant. I'm the resident badass around here. Thank you very much. <laughs> you just said that out loud. Uh, see, Bruce, it's her first day, and I'm already embarrassing her. Interesting. Don't. Too late. Already touching. Just be careful. What a strange thing. The circuitry design. It's elaborate and unorthodox. Almost intentionally so. Like whoever put it together is kind of showing off. Huh. Micro pulse waves? It's just weird. Seriously, what is this thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's like whoever made it. That's pretty cool, huh? I don't know if cool would be the word I would use. I can hear it hum. What does it do? That's what we're trying to work out. You guys are lucky I'm here to help. Uh, help with... Figure this freakish thing out. Uh, Tiffany did graduate first in her class at Cornell in molecular engineering. Let me take a crack at it. I can help you get to the bottom of this. Mm. Figure out what it does. Uh, yeah, the more the merrier. Help is needed. All right, if you think you can help, then be my guest. Oh, I know I can help. I just gotta let him know that I won't be finishing up orientation. Uh, no problem. Oh, I was planning on swinging by the manor after work to see Alfred. I heard he wasn't doing so well. That he was having some issues with his health? He is, but part needs company. He would love that. I hope he isn't still angry with me and Luke about that incident with the China. Well, you know, Al, no one messes with his dinnerware. Catch you guys later. Welcome aboard, Tiffany. Thanks, boss. All right, then. Time to crack this puzzle. I never told her, you know. Told her what I really do at Wayne Enterprises. What uh, we do. Oh, if you're oh. willing to pull her into this Riddler project, why not consider bringing her into the fold? Mm. Into the mission? Interesting. We're going to need help. If we're going to be dealing with the likes of Riddler. And we can trust her. She's family, after all. I like it. Well, if she's anything like you... She's better than me. Okay. Then... Let's give her a shot. Great. I'll start thinking about how we can broach the subject with her. In the meantime, Riddler's puzzle will be a fine start. Well, shall we go down to the lab? Actually, the equipment we need is down in my office. We'll get this taken care of in no time. Mr. Wayne. Uh, yes? I'm Special Agent Damn, Avesta. they're my front door. This is my partner, Special Agent Blake. Fuck. Uh, oh, cool. Well, I guess I'll see you in a bit. I'll be down in my office. Whenever you, uh, get down here. I'm right there. I'll be down in a few. No worries. I'll, uh, start without you. Sorry for the unannounced visit. We're with the agency's behavioral analysis unit. We just came by to ask a few questions. Uh, I sure hope I'm not in any trouble. Oh, everyone's in some amount of trouble. <laughs> it's my job to find out just how much. All right. Play cool here. Cool. Can't get any crucial information. Oh, it's just a file. This office, it really represents you. Well, I like to think so. Is this you? Yeah. How old? I don't know, seven, eight, maybe. <laughs> so happy. After everything you've been through, I don't know how you still do it. Do what exactly? It wasn't long ago when you were the most hated man in Gotham. Yet you still give so much back to the city. 
why do you continue to help Gotham? Most people wouldn't be so charitable after that. What's that all about? Uh, it was just calling. How's it going down there? I uh, left that file on your desk. Think you could bring it down? I'll be down in just a second. Sorry about that. What were you saying? I was saying you're a bit of a mystery. What, uh, what is it you want? Yeah, this is the agency recently brought me in to draft a psychological portrait of the Riddler. We've been tracking him for months, but haven't been able to find him. Not like well, I'm sorry, I think you were in the wrong place. You see, I don't really consort with criminals, or international terrorists for that matter. Yeah. <laughs> uh, something to say? Really? Because our sources say otherwise. A lot of things happened to you last year, and not all of them were good. You put yourself at risk when you helped bring in your friend, Harvey Dent. He was a violent psychotic at the time, almost destroyed the city. Come to think of it, you've been associated with quite a few psychopaths over the years. I Damn. wouldn't go that far. I would. The okay. criminally insane, Straight connect they the dots. seem drawn to you. Either that, or you're often in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yes, having money and fame makes you an easy target. I've had my fair share of crazies knocking on my door. Like this guy. I think you'd know him as John Doe. Shit. We understand that it was during your stay in Arkham where you and John met and became friends. From the sound of it, you two were close. Cool. You've got to be kidding me. He's no friend of mine. That's why you came here to ask me about that guy? According to hospital records, you and John were involved in a riot. They captured the whole incident on video. I saw you flee after John cut another inmate, a man named Victor Zaz. Several people were hurt. Mm. That's a riot. I got out of there as fast as I could. I don't blame you. You must have been scared. John was discharged from Arkham months ago. She's no out. one has Fuck. seen or heard from him since. I was thinking maybe you have. <laughs> Why would you think that? He listed you as his emergency contact. Oh, sounds like you two were pretty close to me. I didn't agree or consent to that. I did not agree to that. <laughs> Why would he write down my name? Obvious. You're important to him. Well, I haven't seen or heard from him, so... Did he do something wrong? He's a person of interest. You see, we've got a wall in the office with a bunch of photos pinned to it. Two-Face, Penguin, Lady Arkham, you know, Gotham's most notorious. They've got all these little strings connecting them to one another, like a web. And you, my friend, are at the center. You keep pretty strange company for someone who wants everyone to think they're such a stand-up guy. What are you trying to prove? What's your point? What's your point? <laughs> and your point is what exactly? That I'm some kind of criminal mastermind? Or just really unlucky? You know more than you're letting on, Mr. Wayne. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you don't trust us. Or maybe you're a criminal, like your father. Maybe oh, she went the there. Hero people think you are. What the fuck? Wait, get the get the fuck get out. The hell out of my. She went there. Fuck. That's an evacuation go there. warning. Get, 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 it's out. time for you to leave. We'll pick this up another time. yourself out what are you talking what did you figure out i've i've solved the riddler's puzzle bruce uh, riddler really pulled a good one over on us i might still be able to disable it but uh, it doesn't look good lucius please tell me what's wrong tell tiffany that i love her that i'm sorry i wasn't around more lucius we really made a difference, didn't we, Batman? Lucius! Fuck! Lucius! Fuck. Oh my god. Lucius! No! Fuck, holy.
shit. One killed and 14 injured after a tragic explosion. The GCPD is opening an investigation into what they are calling an industrial accident. Wynn Enterprises Chief Technology Officer Lucius Fox died last Tuesday in the violent blast. A small service is being held for the tech giant and father of three at Divinity Church this Sunday. Fuck. R.I.P. Lucius. You were a great friend, great partner, loving father, good soul. Rest in paradise, bro. I'll look at it. You don't have to worry, Lucius. Tiffany, I'm gonna take care of your family as if they were my own. Just like Lucius took care of you. Lucius helped raise you, Bruce. It was family. Riddler's attack on the casino was one thing, but this, this is personal. We can't let him get away with it. Riddler struck at the heart of our operations and tore a family apart in the process. Don't worry, Al. I will find him and bring him to justice. He will spend the rest of his life behind bars. I'm glad to see your sense of duty still reigns supreme. Of course, it won't bring poor Lucius back. I can't imagine how devastated she must be to lose her father in such a violent way. <laughs> I should go talk to her. Yes, she can use all the support she can get. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Tiffany. I still can't believe he's gone. None of this. None of this feels real. Yeah. Tries to take care of her family. Your dad was like family to me. If, if there's anything I can do, anything at all, please let me know. <sighs> Thanks, Bruce. I appreciate it. He loved working for you, you know? They hardly saw him at home because of it. Mom used to complain my little brother was growing up without a dad. Now I guess it's true. He was so busy. I can't remember the last time I got to hang out with him. Just father and daughter. I just thought there'd be more time. There were so many things I wanted to talk to him about. So much wisdom in that goofy head of his. Mm, my part. I asked a lot of him. Maybe too much. And he gave it all, didn't he? A real company man. Well, I hope it was worth it. <sighs> Tiffany... I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't blame you. <laughs> hey, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Just let it out. I'm just trying to wrap my head around it all. I saw his remains, Bruce. There, there was hardly anything left. What were you guys working on that could have caused that? It, it doesn't quite to add up. Play it smooth. Please tell me. For my own sanity. I can't share that with you, Tiffany. I'm sorry. What? What do you mean? It's not right now. I mean, it is need to know. I need to know. Bruce, I need answers. 
And I can't give them to you. Fine. Just tell me one thing. That weird disc. Was that what killed him? Did you put my father's life at risk for that? I'm begging you. Just tell me that one thing. I need to know. Her, this is his daughter. I want to. You know what? I'll be truthful with her. She deserves I it. thought it was safe, Tiffany. I, I really did. I had no idea Lucius could get hurt. Please forgive me. Forgive you? I hope you can forgive yourself. Whatever you got my father into, I will find out. And I will shout it to the world. Damn. Should I be honest? Man, she's mad at me. So sorry, really. It's oh, I know that voice. At least he went out with a bang, right? <laughs> Oh, shit. For that, we can all be grateful. The funeral, you, John. You really? knew my father. Well, no, but judging by all the lovely people here, he must have been quite a man. Yeah, I was at least Either that him. or he left a lot of money. Excuse me? <laughs> <clears throat> Just saying. He seems popular. <laughs> Much beloved. Whoa, whoa. What the heck? Seriously, Bruce? This guy's with you. I'm so sorry. I will handle this. Jeez, Bruce, that's quite a grip. Gonna leave a bruise for sure. What are you doing here? I told you I'd see you again, didn't I? You and me, we're two threads in the same stitch. Look, I, I, I got you a little something. Just to mark the occasion. <laughs> I knew you'd be hurting, see? I thought it might make you feel better. I did when I was going to buy it and write it. Um, thank you, John. That's very considerate of you. Oh, good. I wasn't sure. First time at a funeral, you see. People get upset at the littlest things. It hasn't, um... It hasn't been easy for me out here, you know? I'm the new guy now. It's the freedom that gets to you. There's so damn much you hardly know what to do with it. <laughs> It's not like Arkham. <laughs> Sometimes I miss those padded walls. You knew where the lines were drawn. Which ones not to cross. There we go. I want to How did you get out? Oh my god, did you escape? <laughs> Didn't have to. Dr. Leland signed the papers herself. She always had a soft spot for me. If everyone could please take their seats, uh, we will begin. Would you just sit down? Today we gather to honor the memory of Lucius Fox. He was a friend. A father. A husband. A leader. You are crashing my friend's funeral, John. You better have a good reason. Oh, I do. I need that, uh... Favor you owe me for settling the score with Zaz and you know getting you out of Arkham. Shit, you're, you're gonna do right by me, aren't you? I know you're a man of your word. Yeah, I did. You need to get me out. That's an honor. I give you my word, didn't I? I'll stand by it. I knew. The moment we met, yeah, for, friends yeah. for life. I give credit where credit's due. He's the reason I'm out of Arkham fast. Got out fast, good. You see, I met some inspiring people out here. Made some new friends. Made a kind of pact. 
They're amazing, Bruce. That special breed who live by their own rules. They remind me of you. Of your father. So who are they? You'll find out when you meet them. They're looking to bring someone like you into the fold. You, you will meet them for me, won't you? Please? I've, I've got a lot riding on this. I already told them you would. Please don't let me down. I'd be happy to chat with your friends, John. Just say when and where. Oh, I was so hoping you'd say that. I do owe him one. Shit. We are going don't. to have so much fun. I want to be a backstabber. Just one time. I knew this would work out. This air between us, this is real. You can't force this kind of friendship. I want to commemorate the moment. The guys will be so excited. Now, what filter should I use? Uh, you know, just get over with. Thank you, Bruce. Ooh, that's a good one. I just know you're gonna hit it off with the guys. I should warn you though, I've got an enemy. Real piece of work. Calls himself the Riddler. How do you know the Riddler? Know him? I wanna rip his eyeballs out. He's a thief and a killer, and worst of all, he's He's rude. I tried to let the authorities know the kind of low life they're dealing with, but... Wait a minute, you know him too. Of course, a man of Bruce Wayne's caliber knows everyone. Though I shouldn't be surprised. How Not your you know usual that? crowd, though. It isn't my secret. Or so I thought. Uh, just from the news. The guy's clearly a murderer, sick in the head. I don't know the half of it. If I had my way, that smarmy know-it-all would never leave his hole. You mean his hole? You know where he is. No, no, not exactly, no. Maybe I said too much. Mm. You might know. Got earnest trust. I'm your friend, John. You can trust me. Uh, trust is the mainstay of any healthy relationship. I want that for us, Bruce. I really do. Yeah, I, I really don't know much. I heard the egomaniac always made people go to him for meetings. Somewhere in the East End. Where in the East End? Honestly, that's all I know. And even that might be out of date. If you're so eager to find him, why don't you let me help you? I'll find out where he is and get back to you. See if I can't find out where that jerk puts his head down. It'd be just like the old days. I need help for now. I would appreciate that, John. That's what friends are for, Bruce. Just meet mine later, like I ask. Look, I think I outstayed my welcome here. I'm. I'm just gonna slip away. Excuse me. It's, uh... It's been so nice catching up, Bruce. I miss this. This trust between us. That was a little sketchy. You know what? Fuck it. Me too, John. Be in touch. Goodbye, Bruce. Until next time. Intriguing fellow. Certainly not one for decorum. I don't think that camera flash went unnoticed. Well, whatever you say about John, he gave me a lead on Riddler's location. Inform Gordon. Tell him to drag up GCPD records on Gotham's East End. And tell him we're on Riddler's trail.
enjoying the view. Eh, hard to do these days. It's one thing for the bad parts of town to get uglier, but when places like Wayne Tower start falling apart, it makes you wonder what's next. Eh, I bet Bruce Wayne is wondering the same thing. Seems like the world's got it out for that guy. Spends some time in Arkham, gets drugged through the dirt by the media for something he didn't do. Finally picks himself up, and what happens? Someone bombs his company. Bruce Wayne picked himself up once. He could do it again. Well, he certainly showed us that much, didn't he? You said you had a lead on Riddler. Hiding somewhere in the East End. Why am I not surprised? East End's been a no man's land since Harvey Dent blew it up. I've tried to get more patrols out there, but City Hall's not giving up the funds. The area between 42nd and 48th, more or less lawless. That narrows down the search at least. <laughs> Looks like gang activity's heating up along 43rd. Uh, I'll see what I can do. Hey, I get it, but we're stretched thin, I told you. Eh, yeah, Riddler's a loner. I bet he's avoiding that area. A construction site at the center of 46th. Abandoned. Harvey's boys demolished that area, chasing the children of Arkham. There's nothing but a crater there. Not really a place for Riddler to have a hideout. The land at the end of 44th was recently purchased anonymously. Well, the only thing there is an old water tower. Hmm. Something feels fishy about that. My gut tells me that's the place. Agreed. Uh, nice work, Batman. If this leap pans out, Waller will have to eat her words. <laughs> Whatever you said to her at the casino really got up her nose. I have to tell you, I got a bad feeling about her. How so? It's the way she goes after criminals. She's ruthless. Puts her people at risk. And believe me, she doesn't let due process get in her way. No, she's a quite she'll opposite. Stop at nothing. Of and I mean nothing to get her man. That doesn't sit right with me. And I don't think she's good for Gotham. As far as law enforcement goes, Jim, you are the best of it. I don't know many cops with as much heart as you. Uh, I appreciate you saying that. Waller, she doesn't see that as a strength. I was ordered to give her updates on breaks in the Riddler case. Uh, if there's a chance he's there, we should probably let her know. Don't want to give her ammunition with the governor. She's already got him breathing down my neck about what went down at the casino. Uh, keep her at bay. I don't want Waller involved. You and I can handle Riddler. Just like it's always been. Glad to see we're on the same page. We gotta watch out for her. She moved her people into my downtown precinct without so much as a please or thank you. I tell you, Batman, she keeps on chipping away at my authority. I'm gonna crack. Then let's find Riddler before it comes to that. I'll grab a car and meet you at Riddler's hideout. Riddler won't feel so clever after we come knocking. Kept Waller and her agency people out of the loop on this. It's just the two of us. We can handle this without her. Sure can. Not exactly cozy, is it? Let's see what we can learn. All right, let's dig around. Let's see what you got. Uh, yeah. Jones. Someone's keeping a scrapbook. Vane, isn't he? Oops. 
Jesus. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. Alright. Damn it. It's it's stuck. No way to open it from the inside. Then how do we get out? We go in. After you. Alright, let's go in. Crack house any day. Oh shit. Body. Oh God. This. Special Agent Mario Fernandez. Holy crap. He's one of Waller's. Missing. The soul of the other one's almost completely melted through. He's missing parts of his fingers on the right hand. We saw this before. The victim in the casino. No. Let's check his head first. One of his pupils is fully dilated, the other's contracted. A clear sign of brain trauma. Huh. There's no sign of a blow to the head. The man bit his tongue clean through. He must have suffered a shock. Or a sudden jolt. There's some hemorrhaging from the ears. His eardrums must have burst. He was trying to call for help. The phone isn't getting a signal. Damn it. Me either. That's a hell of an invitation. Riddler's playing games. Bet he tried to play alone. We can learn from his mistakes. Let's find out what he did wrong. Alright, let's check everything out. Oh, shoe. One shoe, melted. Must belong to poor Cinderella over there. Alright, let's link some items. The rise connection. Alright, connect that dot to hmm. Scratches on the monitor. The polarizing filter has been tampered with. Like in sunglasses. Monitors typically have a polarizing filter to reduce reflection. I don't see anything. Impossible to see with the naked eye. We're going to have to look at it through a polarized lens. Feature. The senses. They're missing their senses. Like the monkey statues. You're right. There must be a connection. Passes. There are bleeds inside. And a lot of blood. Huh. We know Riddler likes penalizing his victims for wrong answers. Safes with electronic locks. <sighs> Shut tight. These must be the goal of whatever game we're playing. The agent must have been looking for the answer in one of these safes. 
chose the wrong one. Cost him his fingers. Ensuring there's no possible way to open them other than solving his riddles. This is an insane way to commit crimes, even for this city. Fire plays into a giant Faraday cage. Faraday what? An enclosure designed to block electromagnetic fields. No signals in or out. Guess it explains why our phones aren't getting signals. Clever son of a bitch. Alright, so, so things are that complex and labyrinth. Very best style. Uh, but, okay, it looks like they burnish. Okay, let's look around more. I don't want to connect things that. I don't want to connect things until we have everything. How's this? More monkey statues. I'm starting to sense a theme here. Take a look at this. Huh. Well, that's the same kind of body cam the GCPD issues its officers. Maybe there's a clue on the recording. Can't hurt to look. Because you've been so candid with me, I'm giving you a chance your other comrades won't get. A chance at getting out of this alive. We'll catch you. The agency, they'll find I shouldn't have to remind you that you've been chasing me for years. And I've always been two steps ahead. If you win the game, I'll let you go free. And you'll get a consolation prize. An exclusive sneak peek into how I'm going to kill all of your colleagues. <laughs> now, how is that for motivation? Screw you! He had the agent bound while he beat him. That's an agency issue pistol. That's a hell of a jolt. I saw it take down Riddler's goons at the casino. It was impressive. Gotta give it to Waller. Her people have great tech. Anything else? Alright, it's good. Riddler's sick contraptions. Some kind of murder box, I guess. Well, he was always a wacko, but this takes it to a new level. It's still warm. There must be some kind of heating element underneath. This thing is built like an oven. You could be cooked alive in there. Turn me round, but not the right way and you might live to see another day. What does it mean? Won't budge. Must be locked in place. The glass. It's polarized. So it is. Alright, it's a heal element on the floor. I think connected to the shoot I was burned off from the agency's uh, foot. The floor of the box heated up while the agent was inside. He tried standing on one foot to save the other, causing that shoe to catch on fire. When he exited the box, he tried to put the fire out, but couldn't. So he threw off his shoe. Hey, I got a hunch. Come here. No matter how careful Riddler is, chances are good he hasn't scrubbed his own computer. Good call. It's worth checking out. Arms 
He sold technology to Riddler. I talk about strange bedfellows. You know, Waller's been keeping pretty tight tabs on Mari for a while now. She must have known. Just wonderful. More psychos to worry about. He and his colleagues. They don't see eye to eye. Apparently, they don't like his beef with me. Hey, maybe we'll get lucky they'll kill each other. Uh, I recognize some of the names on this list. They're all Waller's people. Names, addresses, phone numbers. We have to warn her. First, we have to get out of here. Polarized wonders. We have to polarize glass in the chamber. If this door were closed, the portal would be looking right at those monitors. Since the monitors have been tampered with, it's likely there's a message on it. One that can only be seen with a polarized lens. You won't know until you're inside the box, though. You got a VR in that cowl or something? Something like that. I've got all the pieces of Riddler's puzzle. Now I need to know what order they have it in. fell off. Once he found he couldn't call for help, he saw the message on the monitors and willingly put himself inside the murder box. The agent's shoe caught fire inside the murder box, so he opened it in a panic. As soon as he was out of the box, he ripped off the burning shoe and threw it. Somewhere in the confusion, he must have missed something crucial. From where he lost his shoe, the agent beelined for the wall of safes. He opened one, but chose poorly. The blade sliced off his fingers. And there he met his end. Though it's still unclear how and when his eardrums could have burst. The agent made a number of mistakes. Mistakes we can avoid. The heat inside the box forced him to run out before he could... Before he could get Riddler's next clue. Poor bastard couldn't withstand the heat. The bat suit's armor is heat resistant. It'll buy me more time to find Riddler's next clue. Getting inside the box and starting the game is the only way we're getting out of here. This is insane. You know that, right? The last man who went in there is dead. There's a good chance it'll kill you, too. Good point. Jim, do you volunteer? Maybe you'd like to go in and solve it yourself. No, go ahead. I wouldn't want to steal your thunder. Okay, here we go. Rising Batman. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. But which one is he referring to? Whichever one it is, the correct safe will have a face with those senses removed. Yeah, I'll check. 
Ah, oh, damn it. It's still locked shut. They should unlock when I open this door. What the hell? Congratulations! You're almost done. That is, if you can withstand my short-range ultrasonic device. Let's test it out, shall we? The riddle! Use it to open the savings! I'll put a stop to this damn noise! Oh, it's on, it's on here. Senses out. God, whatever's in that safe, it'll be worth all this pain. It's a homing missile. What does it home in on? Looking at its schematics now. A signal. A radio signal. A signal. That's... That's how he died. How who died? That's how they'll all die. Riddler. Mori sold me missiles for all of my enemies. Everyone on my list gets one. Most won't even know what's coming. For a brief second, their dull existences will light up before going dark forever. Give up. Well, I have a chance. Turn yourself in while well, you still have a chance. Don't say stupid things, okay? Not when you've just started earning my respect. I'm trying to get a handle on you, Batman. Partnering with Gordon is one thing. From what I remember of the old days, he's harmless enough. We'll see about that when you're in cuffs. But the Agency, they're a natural enemy to people like you and me. You must be desperate if you're making friends with them. You must be really up against the ropes to want that government scum in your corner. They're no friends of mine. No, they're not. They'll smile to your face to get what they want. The Agency uses people, Batman. Corrupts them, breaks their minds. I wasn't always like this. The Agency made me. Oh, this is garbage. Yeah, Waller's a hard ass, sure. But she had nothing to do with why he's so messed up. I didn't say Waller, did I? This goes way before her time. But I don't forget. That's the thing about having a mind like mine. You remember everything. Even the things you'd rather not. Still respond. Yeah, still respond. Whatever happened to you, it doesn't let you off the hook. You're still responsible for all the pain you've caused. You think I'm asking for mercy? I was running things in Gotham before you could walk. I just wanted to see if the man who claims he fights for justice is really as good as he believes. But then, you already answered that for me, didn't you? When you offloaded my puzzle on your friend. Why don't you tell Gordon here what happened to Lucius Fox? Watch out, Commissioner. For all his preaching, Batman knows when to sacrifice a pawn to win the game. It was a smart move. Getting out of the way of the blast. Something only a pragmatist would do. You shouldn't have said his name, Riddler. I'll make you pay for what happened to Lucius. That must be the guilt talking. After all, the poor man's death is on you. Look at Gordon. He doesn't know what to make of any of it. Trust is hard-earned, yet easily lost, isn't it? Come on now. Don't get your tights in a twist. I knew you weren't sharp enough to do it on purpose. 
There's no room at the top for schoolboys who are too squeamish to fight in the gutter. You don't have what it takes to be a player in this town. Not without giving up those values you hold so dear. Game on! I'll wait for Waller and pass on what we found. She won't be happy when she finds out Riddler knows about every agency operative in Gotham. I don't blame her. If they were my cops, no one would be sleeping till we found this Riddler guy. Just keep your eyes open, Jim. In the meantime, I'll stay on Riddler's tail. Hey, hey, hold up a sec. What Riddler said in there about the agency? Smoke and mirrors, you ask me. But the thing about Lucius Fox... And the blast at Wayne Tower? You got a level with me. You got some connection with that Wayne Tech guy you didn't tell me about? Shit, he's on prey on something. I don't want to lie to him. Jim's a good friend. Lucius Fox was an ally of mine. That got him killed. I gotta say, the fact I had to learn about it from Riddler instead of you doesn't sit right with me at all. I thought we had some trust, you and I. What do you expect me to do with this? Am I just supposed to sit on my hands? You are your own man, Jim. You'll come to your own decision. I mean, I wasn't born yesterday. I know you probably have a network of civilians working for you. You can't do the kinds of things you do without a gigantic support system. Oh, to hell with it. I never heard what I heard in there. All right? Batman. I'm sorry for your loss. your discussion with Commissioner Gordon. Now he knows that Lucius Fox and the Batman are, were, allies. Gordon's dangerously close to figuring out who you are. If he does find out, I have no idea how he'll react. It's not a chance you can afford to take. Yeah, Jim's friend, I couldn't lie to him. He looked me straight in the eye, Alfred. He's been our friend a long time. He deserves to know. I understand that, Bruce, but he's still too close for comfort. I'm sorry, but he is. You were radio silent for so long. Tell me, did you find out how Lucius died? This is a missile I found in Riddler's workshop. The explosion at Wayne Tower. We were thinking about it all wrong. The puzzle wasn't an explosive. It was an emitter. When it was solved, it emitted a signal. You heard it earlier. If allowed to play too long, it becomes a launch signal. Dear God, you did solve the box. We just didn't know it. The Batcave Scrambler blocked the signal. Poor Lucius. Wayne Tower offered no such protections. Our tight little family has gotten smaller because of it. All right, guys, give me some water.
It was the three of us looking out for each other. Now it's two. Hmm. Sure, could. With Lucius gone, we need to find someone to take over his role. No one could ever fill his shoes. But, but you're right. Between the Lady Arkham affair and losing Lucius in this gruesome fashion, it's clear we're up against a new class of criminal. This war of ours, it may be too much for us on our own. The list of agency operatives from Riddler's workshop. He plans to do the same thing to them. It's a hit list. It's only useful if he has a way to target the agents, though. And I doubt he's sending them all puzzle boxes. Hold on, let's just walk through it. He's hacked their cell phones. He could pinpoint the location of any one of these operatives. his signal through their phone to make them a target of a missile strike. Can you block it? If I can get a clean copy of the signal, yes. the only way I can get a clean version of the signal. It's pretty grim, Alfred. You don't have to watch. I can handle it. I've never been one to shy away from duty, however unpleasant it may be. Tough. Nice. Thank you. you are a rock, Alfred. I'm always able to count on you, huh? Even in the toughest times. The last thing I want to do is let you down. Bruce, get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. He knew he was going to die. Oh. Damn. Can you switch to audio only, please? Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius? We really made a difference, didn't we? That man? Uh, I, uh, I, I, I shouldn't have watched this. I'll, uh, I'll go get that tea, Master Bruce. All right. Okay. I just need to create a filter to get a clean version of the signal. And then match up the points found in both sound files. I right, link matching words from both sound files. Dwayne. Batman. Tiffany. To the sable. Riddler. Two sounds have to be the same. Tiffany. 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 That's a match. Bruce. 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 Bruce! The waveforms match. There. I've piggybacked under Riddler's cell phone hack. They'll recognize any incoming signal match and shut down, negating the launch. Makes sense for me to have a signal on me as well. What for? Riddler still has functioning missiles. Once he finds out I've blocked his targets, 
You may decide to launch indiscriminately, but with a signal, I might be able to divert them. Tiffany gave me this the day Lucius died. Let's put it to good work. Not a theory I really want to test. So we had better find Riddler first. There is always Riddler's second in command. Eli Nabel, arrested after his attack on the casino. None of the authorities have gotten anything out of him yet. <laughs> Unknown contact. What is it? That John guy, from the funeral, from Arkham. Who... actually sounds like he's keeping his word. Alright, alright. Things are moving smoothly. Hmm, Mori on zero. Why Mori? Mori, huh? John thinks that Mori can get us Riddler's location. You believe him? <laughs> Maybe we should go back to the beginning. Bring Rumi Mori up on the back computer. Either of them could potentially lead me to him. The question is... Eli? We're just another Riddler thug, just hired muscle, only how to start with violence and just aim a gun. On the other hand, Ruby Mori, he did have a connection with Riddler, Sultan weapons. Uh, obviously, there's a personal tension there, and John did uh, they give me the info, the info on uh, how he, he's connected to Riddler. Arms dealer. Uh, I will go with Mori. Mori's a businessman. Given the right incentive, he could be persuaded to talk. He sure can't have any love for Riddler after his attempted murder at the casino. I'd say he'd respond better to a more genteel approach. Peer to peer as Bruce Wayne. However, the agency is watching him. If Waller finds out that Bruce Wayne sought a parley with Mori, shall not be best pleased. On the other hand, Riddler's lieutenant, Eli Nabel, took a go at me in the casino, put up quite a fight. Cracking him will be tougher, more physical. Certainly a job for Batman. He's currently in Waller's custody in a GCPD holding cell. Interrogating Nabel, there would be a visible endorsement of Waller's authority. Court won't like it. Mm, I'll go with Mori. Makes more sense. He has a direct link. He's knowledgeable on this stuff. I want to get rid of her. Maury. I'll meet with Maury. I'm sure Bruce Wayne can find a way to reason with him. Waller's people are here, watching Mori. Riddler's agency surprised. data should make him easy to tag. I need you to keep an eye on him for me. Maybe cause a distraction if I need it. Right. Gotta be careful here. All this attention must be annoying to a man like Mori.
They're following his every move. I see them. All of these agents were on Riddler's list. Even without access to their phones, he'll still try to kill them all somehow. Do whatever it takes to find him, Bruce. I never want to see another video like the one with Lucius. No time to waste. Mr. Wayne, oh, we lost to what do you owe this honor? She lost more. Good evening, Mr. Mori. I've come to talk. Your visit is unexpected, Mr. Wayne. What can I do for you? A private matter between friends. Do hmm. We have a mutual enemy, Mori. He can't go unchecked. Men like you and I have many enemies, Mr. Wayne. I am sure we share more than one. You know the one I mean. The authorities are watching my every move. Apparently, I'm a person of interest. There's really not much I can offer you, other than a drink and a seat at the roulette wheel. Not while I'm being shadowed. We need privacy. Lose the agents. Done. They just got an order to sweep the perimeter. Should give you a couple of minutes at least. Impressive, Mr. Wayne. <laughs> we haven't even... What can I do for you? Information. About the Riddler. Why would I do that? You're on his list, Maury. He's gonna hit you with the same weapons you sold him. You and a lot of other people. I dealt with that maniac, it's true. But I was done after the first delivery. Riddler wanted more. Everything he could get his hands on. He even wanted me to hand over one of my biotech companies. I said no. That's why he attacked you. You have no idea how crazy he is. I wish I had known it sooner. Actually, I have a pretty good idea. I see that you do. He scared me. I was afraid he'd use my goods in the city. After the explosion at Wayne Enterprises, it turns out I was right. I want you to know, I had no idea the Riddler had marked you as a target. I knew your father, back when he was running Gotham. Our interests often aligned. I would never dishonor his memory. He was a friend. Truly one of a kind. Let's go. Oh, so you know my father, so technically did owe me. Then you owe me for my father's sake. <laughs> that was a long time ago. And favors go both ways. I can help you find the Riddler, Mr. Wayne. I sold him the missile array he's using to pick off his enemies. He won't be very far from it. Everything you need to find him is on that drive. But I need a favor from you first. A favor? Walla has me detained here pending Riddler's trial. She controls all my accounts. I need to get out of the country, and in all haste. You can help with that. Otherwise, I fear my fate is a short, miserable life in a black prison. Somewhere deeply unpleasant. That's your problem, Maury, not mine. Come now, Bruce. My problems are your problems, just the like yours is. are mine. A chartered plane waits for me at the airport. The pilot will fly me to a safe haven in the Caribbean for the right price. All you have to do is authorize a transfer. You don't want me as an enemy, Mr. Wayne. Oh, is that a threat? Our agency friends will be back any second. Let's handle this quickly and without disturbance. Everyone gets what they want. That was all funny, Danny, but I'm gonna dip. No deal. Uh, 
This could have been a lot easier for you, Mori. You should kill me, Wayne, because I won't forget! Bruce, Wallace agents are converging. Hurry up and get out of there. Alfred, I've sent you Mori's information. Find me what I need, fast. No, okay, that's good. I'm gonna take the, the flash drive. I thought I was gonna like take it, just run out. But yeah, either way, I got the info. And where's my? Eh, I don't care. I'm gonna take him. A good spot for cover. Some schooling. My friends will be here soon. Oh shit, that bed's I'd right keep there. your mouths shut until then. Hostages first. When they're safe, I can find the missiles. Targeting online now. Ready, Bruce. Possibly think clunking a few heads is enough to make me roll over. Oversized vermin! Interrogating me the whole time. She's like crooked, but like, it's not that messed up. Thanks, Batman. Hi. Are you alright? Playbook, Batman. I know all your shallow tricks. Maury was incapable of learning his lesson. I knew he'd lead you to me eventually. All part of the plan. The missiles. Bait. 
Just like the hostages were bait. I knew you couldn't bear to let these agents die. <laughs> you care too much about the little people. That makes you weak. I saw how you saved Mori. I saw how angry you got about what happened to Fox. Don't think my compassion means I won't hurt you. Don't think I won't beat you within an inch of your life. Hard to do that when you're in a cage. Even harder when you're dead. My partners were supposed to be here to see this. I guess I can just show them the bodies. I'm going to ask you three questions. Get them wrong, one of these agents gets torn apart. Damn, you won't get away with this. You get them right? This happens! I designed this for you, Batman. Gotham's champion of justice will die in an unfair puzzle. Let's get started. We have a lot to get through. I'm curious to see how you'll handle it all! <laughs> it's me you want. Not Agent Avesta. Let her go! Oh no, she needs to be in there with you. You can handle the sonic blasts. But her... I estimate three blasts at most before her insides rupture. This one should be easy, Batman. Close to the heart. I solved a puzzle box for the bat. Now I'm dead. And I mean dismembered. Closed casket for sure kind of dead. Who am I? Oh, fuck. If you know the answer, please say it. My colleagues will die otherwise. Speak up, Batman. Which one of your dead friends am I? I need it. a hint? Starts with the letters L and F. Well, who am I? Lucius. What was that? I couldn't hear you. Lucius Fox. Very good, Batman. You saved a life. But... <sighs> Thank you. Batman, don't answer any more of his questions. No, Blake. I won't let you die. Number two, also completely self-evident. I am black and blue and bleeding from the ears. Who am I? I think... I think he means me. Say it. Don't you dare answer that! Please, don't let him die. Say it! I need an answer. Or click, click, click! Avesta. The answer is Agent Avesta. You got it, Batman! <laughs> Here's your prize! Oh my god! Iman! What have you done? Enough, Riddler. You've made your point. Just one more, Batman. And then it'll all be over. I'll distract him. Just get us out of here. I'm the sharpest mind you'll ever meet. The original genius with Gotham at my feet. Who am I? You're Riddler. Riddler's the genius. Well done, Agent. You answered so quickly, you almost deserve not to get the blast. Go. I'll fire one of the missiles. Use the bad cam to make it target the cage. And use a Riddler's trap to protect Emon and myself from the explosion. I like what you're saying, Agent Avesta, but you're not the one I need to hear it from. Missile armed, ready to fire. Who's the genius, Batman? Who's on top of Gotham now? I want to hear it from you. That would be me. I am. 
What are you doing? Don't you? All right, time for your beating, boy. You don't impress me. You might have bought yourself some time with that trick, but I had backup on the way. You're. Shut up. Shut up. the man who's got no time left. The Riddler. Thought you'd get such an easy one right. Those missiles are aimed right at the city. The answer is Batman. Be happening. Take a punch. I didn't think we were going to make it. I, I thought... You're reckless, Iman. You're lucky you're alive. Agent, are you okay? My ears! I can't hear! Cell. Well, congratulations, Batman. You managed, even in my twisted game, to keep everyone alive. But at what cost? Agent Investus suffered, so no one had to die. That can't sit well with you. Can it? Must be an uncomfortable feeling. This entire twisted situation is your doing, Riddler. All blame is on you. And so are the consequences. You came after me, you know. Not the other way around. I made you hurt an innocent woman to get to me. <laughs> oh, my comrades would have been impressed. 
set this all up to show them. I thought they'd back me up, even if they didn't agree. They, they left me here to deal with you alone. They, they betrayed me. They didn't come. I'll come after them. I look forward to meeting these friends of yours. They're next on my list. Good. They deserve it. Unless... Unless that white-faced prick set me up. Never told them to meet me here. Mark, for you. Fuck. Lock the ship down. Radio for more medics. But Riddler, is he? Oh, God he damn it. Oh, this isn't good, Batman. The investigation is a dead end without a breathing suspect. We're in trouble. A lot of trouble. I have no idea how we're getting out of it. That's all on me. You don't have to worry, Jim. I'll take the heat for this. Now, I appreciate the thought, but that ain't gonna cut it. Oh, Waller is gonna come down on us like a thunderbolt. Thunderbolt? I'm the whole goddamn hurricane. I'm about to blow both your asses off the side of this ship. This is a goddamn mess. Agent Avesta is dead. Riddler is dead, and I don't know exactly how, but I know you tampered with my suspect at the casino. Unless you expect me to believe that Maury's new neck brace is a fashion statement. Batman is clearly being misused as an asset to the GCPD. I'm taking direct control of law enforcement in Gotham, effective immediately. What? Gordon, you're being relieved of your stars. Bumped down to deputy ops. You can't demote me. I just did. Don't like it? Go cry to the governor. I generously let this cowboy crap with the Batman go on out of respect. Now wait a damn but minute! But I can see now that that was a uh, mistake. Fuck it. I'm, I'm loyal to Gordon Waller. Don't expect me to start taking your calls. I'm not asking you for your cooperation, Batman. I'm ordering it. When you understand what we're facing, you'll come around. Take some vacation days, Gordon. I've got sensitive case details to discuss with Batman. We're still in this together, Batman. This doesn't change a thing. Oh, shit. This city is about to find itself in a crisis the likes of which it's never known. Riddler had a crew. Not just any crew. The worst criminal minds from all over the world, here in Gotham. You come across anything about them? I'm assuming you've heard of them by now. Let me know if you have anything to share. I give you shit. Do your own dirty work, Waller. You'll get nothing from me. That's a real shame. No one's better suited for this job than you. Evidence in his workshop suggests he was involved in a feud with another man. Dr. Harleen Quinzel, former psychiatrist at Arkham Asylum. She's very elusive. Keeps her head down. Much more so than that show-off right there. He was going to be my way in once we captured him alive. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line. 
and knows exactly when to cross it. Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce Wayne. Oh my God. Alright, here we go. 